What's going on, guys? Ollie uh, from Ollie Rosewell and uh, formerly Response AI. Um, we've actually recently sold that company, and I'm moving on to sort of new projects um, that are obviously going to be challenging me again. And I'm going to be, uh, you know, sort of documenting all of that on YouTube. I'm actually building a competitor analysis tool that will help companies keep track of their competitors, pricing changes, updates, events, that kind of thing. And uh, in doing this, I obviously need to reach out to uh, startups. And there's a tool called tricome.com. Um, and for about $67, $68, um, you get 150,000 verified decision makers of uh, you know startups and SaaS companies. So this is not your sort of typical, uh, you know, Apollo data or sort of cheap data. Uh, it sort of costs thousands to, uh, you know, sort of maintain. You've obviously got industries and keywords. You've got technologies. You can filter by revenue, funding, the latest funding rounds, that kind of thing. And there is a lot of different sort of filters that you can run. You can save the exports uh, to the exports page. And then you can obviously download them, that kind of thing, all that kind of stuff. The whole point is that this database is not as saturated as a lot of other databases. You've got a lot of leads that are really, really well sort of, uh, you know, maintained. And it costs a couple thousand dollars to, to really sort of manage this data and, uh, and, and clean it up, really. So if we just sort of use some of the example kind of uh, filters, you've obviously got, uh, you know, the employee count. You've got the minimum revenue per year of the actual companies. You've got the minimum total funding that the companies have received. And then you've obviously got things like the funded between dates so that you can have recently funded companies or whatever you want. You know, what we're going to do now is we're going to obviously filter by things like CEO. You've got owners, let's add and let's add founders. And we've now got 32,000 verified email addresses of founders in these sort of SaaS companies. I'm actually going to make sure that they are between uh, 11 to 50, which is like a decent kind of uh, range for doing outreach because they're not going to be massive companies and they'll probably respond. We're also going to go to keywords and make sure they are cloud companies, AI companies, let's say finance and fintech companies. And we've now got 5,000 founders and CEOs of these companies that are inside this bracket and are inside the cloud, AI, finance, fintech kind of thing um, and that kind of sort of area. What I'm obviously going to do now is you can head over to the export button and I'm going to click export data. And in a couple of seconds, the export will finish. So the export is finished. Obviously not going to save that. I'm going to go back and just sort of go through a bit of a tour of the table again. So you've got the industry and keywords. You can open up the tab so that it goes sort of, you know, deeper into the technologies and the industries, that kind of thing. You've got the technologies here that you can also open. And then you've obviously got the revenue and funding, etc. You can filter by technology as well. So if we make sure we want to know that the company is using Gmail, you can obviously filter by companies that are only using Gmail and then you've obviously got Outlook. And then if we sort of clear these, I'm going to filter by people who are using Webflow. And there's obviously going to be a thousand results and all of these companies are, you know, using Webflow and they're founders, CEOs, decision makers, and they are in 11 to 50 companies. There's pretty much endless uh, sort of possibilities with what you can do with this data. Um, and you get the entire database for $67 um, and you never have to worry about, you know, paying again, basically. So hop into this, guys. I strongly recommend it. Um, all the data is really, really clean, low bounce rates, that kind of thing. And um, I'll keep you guys updated on, you know, the kind of stuff that I'm doing with my competitor analysis tool. And any problems at all, just give me a shout. Any questions you have, let me know. But also any sort of... Uh, content ideas that you guys have for me just drop them in the comments and we'll get started and uh, i'll take take uh time now to sort of end the video any problems at all give me a shout take care guys good to be back on youtube and uh stay safe